Hey, this is Poetic Will. This is just a special video for myself to you all. I've always loved tech since 2011 or maybe even before that. Just like I'm a fanboy of Apple and probably for Samsung as well. I feel this year it's been a big year for Apple in many ways. Even if this might have been the year, I've been way more happier. I've been in all these years for Apple products to launch year after year. It's the first time in a while I can say I want to build that Apple ecosystem. I want to experience and have it in my life. Not all of them but at least those I like to own, either for personal use or just for the Apple collection of classic stuff. This year Apple has reflected on itself. As well this year I can finally say Apple has done most things right. From going all the way to the base model 128GB across all iPhones as well as iPads in some way. As for MacBook, it feels more like the Dell XPS lineup to me, so with more of an Apple cat. I feel that now we have three different MacBook Pro sizes and depending on which screen size you prefer can go with. Or as I would be saying, pay a bit more extra if you feel you need, need it or want to future proof it for a longer duration. Now that we have Mac Pro 14 and 16 inch, I feel for me the MacBook Pro 14 is good sweet spot. But I would prefer MacBook Pro 16 inch mainly for bigger screen size and those speakers. All I'm saying bigger is better but now everything between the Mac Pro 14 and 16 inch is identical as well as the MacBook Pro 14 inch speakers are damn good even if the notch is somewhat noticeable but on the MacBook Pro 16 inch not much. To be honest I was blown away by the MacBook Pro 14 inch speakers. I feel it sounds loud, crisp and most importantly good enough for whatever you would be using the speakers for on the MacBook Pro 14 inch. I feel in no way the screen size was small for me but with MacBook Pro 13 inch definitely not for me as that's way too small for anything video editing or photoshop. MacBook Pro 14 inch I can do everything I would probably do on a MacBook Pro 14 inch. iPad lineup now has gotten better from the base model to the high end model. Storage hopefully next year goes to base model 128 GB for all iPad as well decent amount of good color wave since only some of the iPad colors this year I like color waves I like as for iPhone I felt for me personally it was a disappointing year with iPhone especially with those hideous camera layers on the regular iPhone features were okay nothing great colors I feel were good especially that pink iPhone in person looked really nice as for the iMac and Mac mini there are some sort of upgrade internally needed so overall they are great for those who need it personally I wish Next year Apple brings the MacBook Pro base configuration to Mac mini lineup as that would be a win-win for all of us and not just for Apple. Oh did I forgot to mention I really wish Apple sells these iMac keyboards to the general consumers as well as those who are on the Mac ecosystem. I really love those iMac keyboard colors. I might have not put the trigger to the product I, I love a lot. Hopefully next year and probably MacBook Pro in near future. Do let me know what all Apple products you purchased this year for yourself or for someone else. Till then this is your Poetic Will. Do like, comment and subscribe to the channel. For more awesome videos, live your dream.